a lot has happened during this pandemic. Families, relationships, businesses, and almost everything have been affected. The future is uncertain. Young people are skeptical about what lies ahead. However, in the midst of all the chaos and mayhem, we are confident that God is in control. Hi Zion, how was your day today, girl? It was frustrating. Why? It's just my my supervisor is not replying to mm -hmm. my emails. It's not responding to my messages, not even calls. So I I just don't know what will happen to my dissertation. Mm. Listen, child, don't worry. Everything will be all right. When? How? I'm Which? Telling you, it all the time you are telling me that it will be okay. Relax a bit. Hear this. Hear this. Um, some time ago. You wanted to speak to me about something. I think it was urgent. I was busy. Let's talk about it now. I'm not well, ma'am. Let me, you know what? Let me finish dinner. Mm. And then after dinner, after we eat, we'll talk about it. Sounds like a good idea. All right. I'm feeling hungry. Thank all you, All right, mommy. so we'll catch up in a bit, all right? All right, mommy. Ever since this man has left us, life has had its challenges. Zion, she remains unshakable in her education. She's excelling. She's really trying her best. I'm trying my best. What do you mean, what's my problem? Oh, excuse me? Why are you talking to like that? What? Who are you talking to like that? Who's this? Nah, this is not my boyfriend. Who are you talking to like that? Why are you shouting? I'm gonna shout to you too. Why are you shouting? Why are you shouting? Why are you shouting? You just got a phone call. What's happening? Phone. What's happening here? I don't know. Ma Who was that? I don't know. I don't know. Who was that? Who have you crying? Stop settling for less. Come, come, come this way with me. Come, please. Come on, my dear. You're more than this. What's going on? What happened there early on? Why are you crying like this? My boyfriend, he mm. just said that because of distance, he found a new girlfriend and what? he can't come here. So he broke up with me. That's okay. My supervisor, it's not replying my emails, no messages. It seems nothing is working in my life, mom. Nothing. I'm done trying. I'm done knocking doors. I'm done. I'm done talking to people that will help me, but... I'm here to tell you today, Gil. I'm here to tell you that you're not done. You're not finished. This might just be the opportunity that you're waiting for. A new beginning. 
new doors of opportunity for you to to really be that person that God wants you to be. You forget oh. that you are wonderfully and fearfully made by God. Oh, I'm say God. He is here. He's here for you. Tell me about God. Me, God. Yes. He's able. You need to trust God, girl. These young people would not trust God. They just look at their circumstances and feel that everything is lost. And behind it, there is a, they have a wonderful future. I will just have to continue standing in the gap for her, you know. I, I, my heart hurts to see how she's, she's crying like that. Like if she, she has no hope, not knowing that there is hope in Christ. I have to continue praying for my daughter. I'll stand in the gap for that generation because they need Jesus. Mm. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, hear our cry, O oh Lord. God, right now I come before you in the mighty name of Jesus. Stand in the gap, O oh God, for the young people of the nations of the earth. Hallelujah. In this season of uncertainty, Jesus, in this season of uncertainty, O oh God, I bring them and I lay them at your altar. Hallelujah. For many are going through different circumstances, O oh God, and it seems as if they are hopeless, O oh Jesus. But we we know, oh God, that they will find their hope in you. So right now, oh God, I bring them and I say hallelujah that you would comfort them, that you would strengthen them, oh God, that their help comes from you and you alone, that they would understand that they need a savior. In moments like these, they need an anchor and their anchor must be sure and strong in you. Creator of heaven and earth, oh God, for those, oh Lord God Almighty, who have situations, oh my God, and making decisions in their career path. I pray, Lord God, that you would enlighten their minds and their understanding, oh Father God. Hallelujah. Oh Father, those that are in relationship, it may even be the wrong relationship, oh God. I pray by the leading of the Holy Spirit, glory, glory, He Bosa. by the leading of the Holy Spirit, that you would speak to them, oh God. You would give them the direction that is needed for such a time like this, oh Lord God. Oh Jesus God, you show up in their affairs, oh Lord God, and let them know, Father, that they were designed by you, that they have a purpose, oh God, and no devil in hell will be able to sniff it out of them, oh God. I pray right now in the name of Jesus. Continue, Lord God, to be their shield. Continue, Lord God, to be their buckler. Oh my God, yanda bo satada. I thank you, Jesus, that they would call upon your name. For the name of the Lord is still a strong tower. The righteous run in and they are saved, oh God. Right now they need a savior. Oh God, they're looking for answer. But I want them to, to understand even as I stand in the gap and pray that they ought to lift up their eyes onto the hills from whence cometh their help. Their help can only come from the Lord. For you, oh God, you you are the creator of the heaven and earth. You, oh God, you have the blueprint for their lives, oh Jesus. Oh God Almighty, do a quick work. Do a miracle, hallelujah. Every need that they have right now, be it economical, oh Jesus, oh social, physical, whatever it is, spiritual needs, we know that you are able, oh God, to meet them at the point of their need. Do so right now in in Jesus' name, hallelujah. What's going on with that face? Good morning. 
I'm sorry, Mama. You're sorry, Mama? What's happening? What have you, you had a bad dream? <laughs> no, I just, I'm in peace, you know. Mm. I'm light, I woke up lighter. It's like my shoulders, I, I just fine. I'm well, I'm in peace, I'm more comforted. So I just wanted to say I'm, I'm sorry and I want you to forgive me for being rude to you yesterday and throwing you stuff all over. I'm really sorry for what I've done. Okay. I forgive you. That mouth need to be curbed, but I forgive you. Uh, just okay. a, a, a little word of advice, you know, as you go through life, you know. Remember that your present situation would never be your final destination, you know. Because it's a process. It's a refining, it's a rebuilding, you know. God, you know that word, right? Yeah. God is working through you and he's working it out. Listen, in spite of everything that you're facing, everything that you're seeing happening, you know, COVID is here, it's all over, it's global. Mm. You would make it. You would be able to succeed. I want you to develop a prayer life. Let mm. prayer be your priority now in this season. Let it be the situation that you're encountering, you know, things in school, you know, uncertainty about your career, that field. Oh, well, he's gone. That's all right. Life goes on. Let your life now be focused about about let it be all about God and know that there is hope mm. know that there is hope because hmm, he has great plans for you mm. he has great plans for you and that is a promise mm. all right that is a promise he has plans you know because he is the creator of the universe and because he has the blueprint for your life mm. he has great plans for you plans to see you elevated and and be promoted listen hear me daughter don't let anybody take your shine don't let anybody dim your light all right you are great you remember what i told you yesterday i know you were upset eh? but do you remember that i said you are wonderfully and fearfully made, fearfully made. yes say it with me i am i am wonderfully wonderfully and fearfully made and fearfully made yeah in his image in his image yes and feel it i know that you're feeling it in your spirit right now yes, yes there is hope there is hope for you there are open doors of opportunity even in the midst of covid mm -hmm. take this time and even try and develop some skills you know look at life with a new eye new perspective because once there is life there is hope all right so love you so much baby thank you i'm hungry all right i need breakfast there we go